In August 2022, the Pan American Health Organization engaged adolescents from around the region within the framework of Adolescent Pregnancy Prevention. The Caribbean observes Adolescent Pregnancy Prevention Week in October annually. Pauho Country Representative Reynold Hewitt says for the 2022 observance, Pauho provided the platform for writers between the ages of 12 to 19 through the Adolescent Voice Contest to lend their voice to the topic. In this contest, we had over 200 creative pieces being submitted from 22 countries. Uh, the participants competed with original works created exclusively for the contest and selected from eight categories, comic, drawing, illustration, narrative, painting, poem, song, and video. Mr. Hewitt says the judging process was led by jurors from PAO and Youth for Health groups. Six species were selected from two categories. The categories were separated into age groups 12 to 15 and 16 to 19. We had St. Lucia taking home the second prize. And today, we are here to recognize Sian Alfred for representing St. Lucia and bringing back that second prize here for us. So on behalf of Dr. Amalia Del Rigo, the PAHO Director for Barbados and the Eastern Caribbean, I take pleasure in recognizing her and congratulating her for her hard work in this category. Cyan Alfred, a CXC student of the Viewfort Secondary School, is the second place winner of the PAHO Adolescent Voices Contest. Alfred presented her piece titled, When All is Said and Done, to the ceremony's attendees. I don't feel joy or anger, just an overwhelming amount of grief. I feel the urge to mourn the person I was nine months ago, to plan a somber funeral with a freshly primed wooden casket to harbor the lifeless body, a body which won't appear. I am the lifeless body, a surreal phantom even, a real life zombie roaming the earth. But I also feel crippling guilt. I feel like an asteroid. You know, the heavy weight which brings devastation and darkness only to vaporize into nothing? Minister for Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs, Honorable Moses Jabatis, expressed much joy at Alfred's accolade. He says the competition not just inspired creativity, but used a different means to inform on the topic. You cannot get the messages across only through lectures or through um, um, speeches by by ministers or even doctors and nurses and so on. Sometimes you have to allow the creativity of the participants, the, the young people, to come out. And I'm sure Sian will tell you in the whole process of writing poetry or writing stories, you, you change because you are crafting the, the, the message. And because you are crafting the message, you have to internalize it. And because you must internalize it, it will change you. It will cause you to think about teenage pregnancy in a different way. The prize-giving ceremony was held at the Viewfort Comprehensive Secondary School. For the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs, I'm Sant Justin.